William MacDonald was an Australian soldier of the Great War. Born in Australia in 1880, in what was then the British colony of Victoria, MacDonald's family was of Scottish descent. He moved to New South Wales and as a young man he joined the New South Wales Scottish Rifles as a part-time volunteer soldier. The regiment wore full Highland dress uniform with a cap badge and plaid brooch displaying the lion rampant of Scotland. But these were left behind when MacDonald went to war. In 1900, as an underage volunteer, he served with the 1st New South Wales Mounted Infantry in the South African War. This silk ribbon is a souvenir of his time in South Africa. In 1914, he was back in Australia and serving again as a part-time volunteer with the New South Wales Scottish. When war broke out, he enlisted immediately for overseas service. With his experience from South Africa, he was made an officer in the 4th Battalion of the Australian Imperial Force. This photograph shows him in his Great War uniform with its distinctive Australian slouch hat. His campaign medal from South Africa can be seen on his chest. The photograph was taken just before MacDonald and his unit set sail, late in 1914, for Egypt and Gallipoli. The Anzacs of the Australian and New Zealand Army Corps made their reputation fighting bravely in the disastrous Gallipoli campaign. MacDonald was wounded twice and mentioned in dispatches for gallantry. As a souvenir from Gallipoli, MacDonald kept the shrapnel ball and rifle bullet which surgeons had removed from his wounds. He recovered to serve with his battalion on the Western Front. William MacDonald was killed in action on the 16th of August 1916 at Mukay Farm during the Battle of the Somme.